Chelsea here. As part of our What God Looks Like series, you'll hear musician Talib Peshkapia from Mystic Mercy as he shares new music and the story behind his music. We're calling it Storytelling with Mystic Mercy. In this episode, Talib is joined by his wife, Crystal, for a song titled Be On My Mind. Inspired by Psalm 8, Talib wrote this song as he was awestruck by the bigness of the universe. Also inspired by the prayer, The Empty Vessel by Martin Luther, Mystic Mercy's newest song is a song of encouragement, a song that will prompt you to look at the world and connect to our great creator. If you'd like to learn more about Mystic Mercy, please visit mysticmercymusic.com. When I consider thy heavens, the work of thy fingers, the moon, and the stars which you've ordained. Hi everyone, this is Talit Peshkapia from Mystic Mercy, and the song you're listening to today that we will be discussing and dissecting is called, Be On My Mind. This song was inspired by Psalm 8, 3-4. It says, When I look at your heavens, the work of your fingers, the moon and the stars which you have set in place, what is man that you are mindful of him, and the son of man that you care for him? And I don't know if you've ever stared at the stars, just quietly, and or if you're in the big city, like I'm in LA, so it's a little difficult to get star time. But if you go to the Griffith Observatory... Let me tell you all right now, if you ever visit L.A., go to the Griffith Observatory and make sure you get a ticket to the Dome show that they have. And it's beautiful. It's gorgeous. The the way that they take you through space and and the origins of it's just like it's fantastic and bonkers big. And I remember going with Crystal and. It's such a trick. What they do is they put you in this place. It's sort of like you're in hypnosis because it's it's very religious, actually. <laughs> they put you down and they lay you down and you're looking up and you're, you're very vulnerable. You're already sort of open into this idea of what's going on. I don't know. And then, bam, it's the planetarium. It's huge. It's this magnificent thing and it really shrinks you. Like if you felt small, this is going to make you feel really small. And I remember weeping just crying couldn't stop i was bawling just the tears flowing out of my eyes i couldn't stop for me being in that room i had a profound spiritual um, awakening a spiritual movement that happened within my heart and my soul it just it shook me and i remember thinking wow this is fantastic even if it's not god right like there's this sort of cynical side and it's like even if there's no god uh, this is bonkers. This whole thing is, is wild. Uh, I'm just profoundly amazed that we're here. And so uh, this song came out of the, that experience and also sort of thinking upon that and also thinking upon the Bible verse that I read. Make me a vessel for you. So there's one more major inspiration that I'm going to share with y'all. It's The Empty Vessel by Martin Luther. Not Martin Luther King Jr., but Martin Luther. This is one of my own personal favorite prayers, and I'll read it here. Behold, Lord, an empty vessel that needs to be filled. My Lord, fill it. I am weak in the faith. Strengthen me. I am cold in love. Warm me and make me fervent that my love may go out to my neighbor. I do not have a strong and firm faith. At times I doubt and am unable to trust you altogether. O Lord, help me. Strengthen my faith and trust in you. In you I have sealed the treasure of all I have. I am poor, you are rich, and came to be merciful to the poor. I am a sinner, you are upright. With me there is an abundance of sin, and you is the fullness of righteousness. Therefore I will remain with you, of whom I can receive, but to whom I may not give. Amen. So putting all of those together, 
We've got the psalm. We've got Martin Luther's prayer. We've got this moment that was so profound for me where I'm feeling so tiny. And and yet it's still, there's beauty in that, you know, moment. It was something that was bigger than myself. And it, it was, there was immense pleasure in realizing the unique situation called life. Realizing how tiny I was actually gave me this sort of perspective that was larger. Admitting that I'm small gave me a new perspective lifted it elevated me and going from there from those three places came this song and i'd love to read the words that i wrote uh very much obviously inspired by what i've read to you um but i'll take the time here and it says when i consider thy heavens the work of thy fingers the moon and the stars which you've ordained i can't fathom these thoughts are far beyond my reach i bow and i call upon your name be on my mind lord be on my heart more. Make me a vessel for your will always. Be on my lips, Lord. Be on my thoughts more. Make me a vessel for your will always. Stars that cry to you abound in multitude, a sea that roars so loudly with your name. My flesh that's flawed, a heart that's prone to wander far from you, O Lord. Take my mind and move it your way. Be on my mind, Lord. Be on my heart more. Make me a vessel for your will always. Be on my lips, Lord. Be on my thoughts more. Make me a vessel for your will always. So what I hope you get out of this song um, out of listening to this song, out of hearing me explain it in the place that I was in when I wrote it, I hope that it encourages you to look at the world and look at the stars and uh, go to the beach and, and watch the sea roar and all of these places, even the forest, even nature. I was talking about the backyard last time, going to just be in, in solitude in, in my mom and dad's backyard and all of the field. Um, and yet there's this profound connection that we get to have and a spiritual connection that we get to have through this. And I hope this song guides you as you are navigating through your own life. And I hope the song is an encouragement to you. And I always, always, always want to let you know you're not alone and you are loved. And I'm just so glad we were able to have this time together. And until next time, be blessed. <laughs>